Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Princess SMP. Here I am, Princess Maholia, in my bedroom. Last time we got very distracted from my royal duties and went on a goose chase to nothing. However, I do think it requires me to hold a council with all five princesses of the realms, which is a little bit nerve-wracking, I'm not gonna lie. My goals this episode are to finish the chicken coop that I promised I would make last time. I will then send a message to each of the princesses, inviting them to the Elven Kingdom. We'll have a little fun tea party, and then I will discuss this strange coordinates that lead to absolutely nothing. We are going to see if I can find some subjects and hopefully get some materials. Um, I did order some things from Captain Craig and I did talk to Theo about getting some puffer fish. So hopefully they have those by now. And oh, it looks like they brought them right to me. That makes my life easier. This must be, oh my God. Oh my goodness. He was not kidding that he had a lot of puffer fish. Okay. What a pearl! <gasps> what can I do with a pearl? A potion of shimmer. What does a potion of shimmer even do? So maybe I will, since I have this already, I will go ahead. Here we go. So this, I think this was paid for, Kino said. Paid. Please pay in two stacks of quartz block is that too is that too much to ask customs <laughs> bill <laughs> side and close there that way it's just a bill I'm a little bit nervous i've never been to the nether before i know my sister has been to the nether before but um because clearly they have a portal to each other's rooms so should be fine this should be fine this should be fine all right let's go Should I leave it here or? Okay. How am I supposed to get? Okay, this. I can get back up here with this. Okay. Okay. All right. Done. That's one thing off my princess checklist. Alrighty then. We shall start building. I think I will build the chicken coop first. And then I am going to build shops for my subjects so that they can start selling things and we can have an economy sort of start. And thankfully, Captain Craig is on in case I somehow manage to perish so he can come save me. Hopefully, he's somewhere in the area. Well, um, <laughs> something happened to all of our chickens. I see someone fixed the fence but it resulted in there being no more chickens left well i guess we'll you know what we'll start from scratch we'll fix up a chicken pen and then we will also um have to acquire some chickens so let's get to work right, okay no oh uh, yes uh, hello hi hi okay okay so were you with the craig yes okay phew all right that's that's very good <laughs> panic Sorry, attack no, I... saved I, I was quite nervous. Uh, probably not for the reasons you're thinking of, though. Well, actually, well, I guess it's probably better if I show you, because I'm, I'm uncertain of how to think about something right now. If you both will come with me just for a moment, please. Okay. Just follow me. So, I'm sure you're aware of your sister, My, Annabelle, my correct? Si oh, yes. I had thought that I haven't seen or heard from her in quite a long time. And I was sort of just assuming that she was quite all right because, you know, she's capable. She's very strong-willed, not usually one to be too concerned about. Uh, I decided to go into her room and didn't see anything necessarily terribly amiss, um, at least at first glance. Oh, but if you take a look, that's who this yeah. room is. Yes, no, no, it is. Um, she, she, um, she came along with us when we moved here, um, and she sort of did her own thing. But I looked over here, and it seems that there are trap doors in her floor. Oh, that's very mysterious. And oh, they lead to a 
door. I see. Outside the castle. Oh, sneaky. I gotta get myself one of these. What? What? <laughs> I'm just kidding. No! I'm no, kidding. No, you do not. <laughs> Either one of two things happened. Either Annabelle had to run from something and quickly left everything in her room, or someone kidnapped her and has brought her to a different kingdom. Are you sure? That sounds really drastic. We would have heard something by now, right? You would think. But, 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 but I will oh, admit, remember we, um, we were dealing with the, um, the search with the book we received and the keys. Yes. And oh. And we went to that location and it was already raided by <gasps> probably another kingdom. Again, these are worst case scenarios and it's very possible that perhaps she was running from something. Maybe someone was trying to get her and she needed to go escape somewhere and she's hiding. I, I don't know. Yes, considering since we've had mysterious books being left leading to nothing... I guess it does cause for caution, but what do we do? I mean, we already need to gather all of the princesses to talk about these these mysterious coordinates anyways. And maybe yes. we can bring that up, um, or maybe we shouldn't bring well, it up well, until they're gathered. Well, I do think, however, if, if one of the princesses from the other kingdoms has taken her... For any reason, or if someone from another kingdom has taken it, they're not going to admit to that openly. I fear if we bring that up in front of them, that it might show weakness for our kingdom. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. Because, yes, I yes, had no uh, idea myself that sh we had an heir missing. All right. That's lovely. Well, I don't wish to apologize for somber news, but I, I know that's very unexpected. Perhaps she could be in trouble. Considering that... Anthony didn't say anything, and none of the knights have said anything. Is it possible that she's one to just go off on her own quite often? She is very capable and reliable, which is why I haven't been worried about checking up on her the last few days. But it just struck me as very odd that when I searched all her chests, they were completely empty, and that she left her flute here as well, of all things. Hmm. But her chests were empty? Yes, if you search them all, they are completely void of anything. Which again means that someone could have come in here and tried to steal things from her, or um, that she could have taken them herself. I, I don't know. There's a lot of missing variables at the moment. Well, if that were the case, then why is the crown still here if they were kidnapped? If I was Robert, the crown would be something I would go for first, since it's oh, very fair price. priceless. Exactly, so oh. yeah, I can look around the land to see if there's any clues as to where she might be. Should we speak to Anthony about this? She, he might know where she is. Why, why would you say that? I don't know. They're siblings, aren't they? Well, I mean, yes, but he would, if he were to know something, it would mean there'd be something that even she chose. Because if she was kidnapped, then he certainly wouldn't know anything, or at least shouldn't know anything, unless he's behind it. But I don't think that of Lord Anthony at all. No, I mean, like... Sowing distrust. I if we don't know for sure if she was kidnapped her room is not in any disarray so it doesn't look like she's struggled she her items are missing so that could mean that she took them with her not necessarily someone stole one since there's still other valuables around there could be a chance that she was stolen by another kingdom but if a kingdom wanted something from the elven kingdom wouldn't they have contacted us and be like hey we have your princess give us this this and that or we go to war, you know? That's my thought. Potentially, um, as we all know full well, every heir is of utmost and equally wonderful importance. Mm -hmm. More important than anything else that could possibly be had. And so if a kingdom were to kidnap, um, sorry, my dogs are rummaging around literally everywhere right now. Um, they're searching for clues. Keep <laughs> they're it up. They're so cute. Um, but uh, if she were to have been kidnapped, Kentucky that would be worth more than quite literally anything that we could possibly give them. There'd be no ransom, because with as many heirs as we have, if people want to take the elves out, all they'd have to do is remove the heirs one by one by one. Oh, that's com comforting thought. All right. Well, who, who would want to do that to the elves? Do we have that, any... You know, it's possible that there could be a kingdom who harbors some resentment uh, toward other kingdoms in general and just wants to continue to assert its own power in that way. So I, I don't know, honestly. Okay. That might be where it would be useful in the case of the council, where you and I can hopefully try to discern if there are any kingdoms that seem to be suspicious or up to something nefarious. 
Okay. I think, though, we should maybe talk to Anthony. Possibly about it. Mention something I mean, I think to him. At least think tell him. If nothing else. Well, yes. No, I, I, I certainly agree. Um, yes, I think we should. Um, I will go put my dogs away. I think they've continued to find out enough clues. And <laughs> I have them in case of extra emergencies, and they've just been sniffing around, as you can see, looking for clues. And it does not seem like they've found anything substantial yet. So hmm. it's probably a good sign, but it also could mean that the scent is dead because she's been gone for so long. So I don't know which is better, um, honestly. Oh, so I'm just going to go put great. these fellows away. If you want to find Lord Anthony, uh, I will join you shortly, I suppose. Okay. Anthony... Hello? Well, we're missing two heirs now. <laughs> oh, he, did, he could just be around the castle. Oh boy. Okay. Well, let's take a look. See. Doesn't doesn't he doesn't he have a tendency to wander off? I'm starting to realize, Captain, that it might just be a family trait of us not liking to just go off on our own. <laughs> Seem to be a very independent bunch of elves. Um, I'm trying to think about where he could be. Anthony, are you in the library? No. Oh, it's hard to imagine him reading books. But I don't know. Maybe he does like books. You never know. Hmm, where else could he be? Do you think he'd be in the front garden? Um, I'm out here, and I don't see anything. Oh! Anthony! I was just... Anthony! 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 <laughs> Anthony! Are you? Anthony! 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 Hello! Earth 2! Hello! What is happening? What is happening? Well, Lord Anthony! <laughs> Lord Anthony! <laughs> I even tried to whack him and it didn't work. Yes, we were. She was, I was, whole system yelling. was following you for quite literally <laughs> like 20 seconds. I was yelling after you. <laughs> I mean, you heard us that before I yelled really loudly. My goodness, that was. Hello. 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 Yes, can you hear us? Yeah, I can hear you now. Okay. Wonderful. okay. Were, were you able to hear what we just said? No. Okay, I was oh, just basically I mean, chasing you, yelling your name. You were pretty impressive. <laughs> I quite literally yelled. I literally, it was, it was quite well timed, though, because I yelled very loudly, and you actually said, like, wait, are you talking to me? <laughs> so, oh. good, good insight. We want to find you because we have um, something urgent to discuss with you. Mm -hmm. Urgent. Yes. Huh. I'm not being shipped away, right? Oh, no, 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 shipped no. away? No. Why would we get married? Huh? Oh. Well, not yet. Not yet. As an heir who is a male, we certainly have to leverage your position as a male in order to get, you know, married at some point. But that's not anything that we're worrying about now. This is actually quite more serious uh, than that. Oh. Well, we just noticed that um, our sister, Lady Annabelle, um, she is not has not been in her room, and none of the guards slash myself slash Kano have seen her. Have you seen her lately? I just assume she does her own thing. Yeah, she never really wanted to hang out with us, so I just assumed that she just wanted to be left alone in her room. Oh, well, she was not in her room and her things were not in her room with her. Besides her crown and her flute, they were there. I just thought to check on her today, and yes, I would, you know, she doesn't have to be in her room, but what concerned me most is that there were trap doors that seemed to have been uncovered in the back of her room, leading to a door out of her room. So she could have been missing this whole time, and we'd never noticed. Correct. Correct. We're bad siblings. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, yes, but, but, the, but I'm the worst for it, because I'm the advisor. I'm not supposed to be checking on all of you, but it, she could be kidnapped. She could be hiding from something. But we don't. We don't know what's happened. I should have checked on her much sooner, and I'm very sad that I didn't. My elven senses are tingling. Yeah, yeah. I think we have visitors. I do see visitors down at the, uh, down there. Oh. I can see if I saw wings, I believe. Wings? 
Like, I've, I've, I've interacted with I've bears before. They're lovely people. Right. Uh, uh, don't shoot man. them. <laughs> We're not going to war with the cloud people. I cannot handle that right now. Oh, right. The nether people. Got it. Oh. No, no, we're not going to oh, war oh, with the nether oh, people oh, yeah, oh. either. This information is strictly confidential, but we won't need to war with the nether people for any bad reasons. We we are currently on the same wavelength. And we're secretly allies with them, basically. Are we keeping that a secret? Mm -hmm. That we're allies? Well, we're, not, well, we're not telling other kingdoms about it, certainly. Um, I guess other kingdoms uh, might get a little bit jealous. And I feel like the more people who know uh, in our kingdom, it might it could get released out. I, I know some of us are a bit more friendly with other people, and so it's just better we keep it. You know, we don't want. We want to make sure that what the princess of the Nether wishes remains intact. Yes. So should we see? We should probably stop talking about private matters when there are guests in our midst. Should we see who has arrived? We can. I do. My, my senses tell me that they aren't nearby anymore, but they were here for a moment, which is concerning yeah, to me. Yeah, I did. Like I said, I did see wings. But at any rate, I suppose we can. Uh, maybe maybe we should learning. walk around and investigate the area a little bit. I mean, we certainly can. I can I can get my dogs again, and we can try and go and search. Um, though it is nighttime, so is it better to try and go to bed first and then? try and do things in daylight mm, yes just stage. for safety purposes let's maybe sleep all right uh, yeah. let's go to bed then and we can go searching after oh, i have senses are tingling oh, no, they don't like it yeah. oh. Uh, hello hello hi uh, hi oh hello again you two we're just nice passing you. through oh, nice, nice path. <laughs> That's a lovely cat there. That's um, beautiful. Thank you. thank you. Yeah, we were delivering a letter to uh, Theo that they're going to be delivering it to you here shortly for um, something. Uh, do you want to say? Um, a meeting with Princess Rain. Oh. Yes. Yes, ma'am. We, we have some things that we need to discuss about some people of yours. Oh, no. Um, okay. Oh, oh great. Oh. <laughs> wrong now. Yeah, um, we're just gonna go on our way. I'm, I'm a little bit scared and nervous. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, thank you. Safe travels. Bye. Safe travels. Yes, uh, thank you. That was concerning. Great. Now we're that is concerning. That's the concerning. cloud princess is mad at us. <laughs> Considering that we just spoke about potentially some kingdoms, and then we'll be get messengers from another kingdom. I guess we'll when Theo arrives with the whatever message they gave him, we'll find out what exactly she wants i believe theo is here oh he's already here um, oh <clears throat> to be discreet instead of being with the welcoming party just waiting anxiously <laughs> for the this is very interesting so many yeah. things are happening at once oh hello my lady um hello i heard you may have a message for me yep oh boy okay how oh, great that's <laughs> labeled concerns okay no what? <laughs> Great. Should I? Shall I read it out loud or to myself? If you wish. It's up to you. Okay. Uh, if you like it, um, greetings, princess. I hope this letter finds you well. I was wanting to address a concern that one of my heirs and my knights brought to my attention. I was hoping we could meet and discuss the matter at your earliest convenience. Warmest regards, Princess Rain. Okay, so yeah, it is cryptic. And she just wants to talk about concerns. Oh dear. Is it earliest convenience? What does that mean? Like now? Probably now, I would assume. Oh, goodness. Maybe should we go to sleep first and then yeah, go we, to we, daytime? Yeah, we probably should. Um, yes. yes. Let's, let's quickly go to bed. If you wish to sleep yeah. in the guards' quarters the, uh, temporarily, then you're more than welcome. Yeah, yeah. Just so we can fa speed up the night. Yes. Um, um, do you, okay, now before you head off to sleep, yes. um, do you think I need to reply to this or just show up at the castle because she did not say she did not specify i think we can just show up as I mean, are you sure because so i'm so. if there's concerns and they're feeling wary the um, seraphs seemed really scared of us for some reason so well, i don't want to be intimidating perhaps, well i suppose if the, the message was given to you theo yes was mm -hmm. that uh an attempt to at least be sort of middle manish in this case yeah then yes, I suppose give the message to Theo. We can send him in advance of us. We can wait a little bit, and then we can go after Theo has left. Okay. And you can message in the message that we're saying that we'll be coming momentarily. 
Um, but we will, you know, be following our messenger. Basically, is the essence. Okay. <laughs> you don't want to experience what happened to me the other day, hmm? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Let's not talk about that. <laughs> I shall prepare a new message for you to send back to the uh, Cloud Kingdom, so they don't. I do have a spare? Oh, so. you do. That's perfect because I would have had to just yes. reuse another one. Why did, did you, she's running the left hand today. Why do you toss her for your garbage? Did you give me garbage? Okay, I'm not gonna sign it just because I I want that back. Make sure you get that back. Because <laughs> we need to of conserve. Course, course. Okay. Right. Wonderful. Okay. Well thank you, Thea. We appreciate your service. You're welcome. I'll be on my way. Um a uh, quick note if you didn't know, apparently they do a weapons check at the Cloud Kingdom, so oh. Well, they don't take the they don't they don't take the weapons. They just make sure like they just account for what you have. Well, Interesting. Quite honest, to be fair. Uh, no, I think I'm gonna burn down the whole kingdom. <laughs> um. Well, we don't know. She might come here. Actually, well, considering the behavior, they'll probably ask us to come to the Cloud Kingdom. Yeah, but it was just a heads up, just in case you didn't know. I didn't. I don't know. know. I haven't heard any news of anyone confessing anything, but. There's concerning things happening all around here today, it seems like. Um, and then maybe, depending on what kind of concerns she has, um, I'll have to mention our concerns as well. That is true. Hello, my lady. Oh, oh the sirens are here. Pretty. Oh, yeah. hello. I hope it's okay oh, that beautiful. all of us came. Um, at least us royals. Okay. Beautiful. Um, yeah, like I suppose we will make house. use no. of our, um, mm -hmm. our tea area. A pearl either way. Yes, so. I think that'd be a good plan. That's I, a fancy I'll hat. Let you, I'll let you know when you're good. Yeah, it is a very That's what I was telling hat. you. It's a nice hat. Wait, I want to see the fancy hat. <gasps> That's an amazing hat. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you um, for the compliments. To... Present your bows. And... Yes. yes. Uh, welcome to the Elven Kingdom, Seraphs and Princess Rain. Won't you follow us up to our tea area and then we can discuss what you came here for yes of course thank yes. you for having us mm -hmm. all right follow me i think we'll do right, introductions we'll, we'll, once we'll we're sitting down yes precisely <laughs> even though some of us have indeed spoken before it never hurts to remind each other who we are um we may not have enough chairs advisors and knights can stand aside you should it have more of the so space actually beautiful here oh. thank you it is breathtaking I love the flowers. Mm -hmm. I suppose I'll facilitate the instructions just to make sure we get those out of the way first. Uh, for those who are unaware, I am Chancellor Kano. I am the advisor to Princess Mahon. Hello, I am Lord Anthony, uh, heir of the Evelyn Kingdom. Heir. Oh, heir. 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 Sorry. <laughs> yes, it's quite alright. And I am Princess Maholia, ruling princess of the Elven Kingdom. And I am Captain Craig, guard, captain of the Elven Guard. Well, nice to meet you all. Mm -hmm. um, I am Princess Rain of Stratus, the Cloud Kingdom. Um, I am Estelle, heiress of the Cloud Kingdom. And I am an heir, and my name is Princess Galaxy. Um, nice to make your acquaintance, and hopefully we didn't steer you guys. We were, we're just a little bit nervous. Um, I'm Iris, the Royal Advisor. I am Cirrus Stormwind. I am the co-captain of the Order of the Silver Lining and Princess Rain's knight. Well, lovely to meet you all officially. Um, please go ahead and tell me what your concerns are. Okay, well, um, Galaxy and Cirrus have both brought to my attention an interaction they had with uh, one of your civilians, I believe. Mm -hmm. um, so we were visiting Theo's neighbor and we had entered into their home and it looked to me as if they had this bee captured on a string um, and it, it looked as if it was dripping blood or if it was being tortured or something like that and as, as creatures with oh. wings um, it just made me nervous okay I see mm -hmm. do you mind telling me the name I believe I... the citizen was Charlotte Yes, it was Charlotte. 
Okay. I'm not sure that it was her specifically. There were quite a few people in that house. Yeah. Okay. I, I will... I they had some visitors. I will investigate the situation and speak with this citizen. And I'll also make sure that either my knights or Countess Artemis um, goes around and does a quality check on all of our enclosures for animals. Make sure that they're um, sustainable and humane. So sorry that you had to witness that. Here in the Elven Kingdom, we life is very important. So we definitely will have to make sure that our own subjects are taking good care of the life around here. So thank you for bringing this to my attention and I will take care of it. Of course, and always good, uh, you know, meeting here. So thank you for you know, accepting our notice on such short notice. Of course. And actually, since you're here, I have another matter to discuss with you, Princess Rain. Oh, uh -huh. okay. So we have received, or well, personally, I had received a pa mysterious package in my bedroom of some coordinates that we had followed and it led to an iceberg that had absolutely nothing to show. It looked like somebody had been there already though. And we, mm -hmm. we were just curious. We wanted to talk to all the princesses if they had experienced the same thing. Well, that's funny that you say that and we hadn't brought it to many people's attentions yet. Um, we, I had also received a mysterious package leading to an iceberg in the middle of nowhere that had nothing around it or anything. So we were also very curious because I don't know how someone got in my bedroom because obviously we are in the clouds and I, I am on the top floor with no stairwell to lead mm -hmm. up to the top floor. So it'd have to be someone with the ability to fly. That's what we assume too, or at least someone that had a way to get up there, whether that be through someone that could fly or spy, I guess that would be a better word mm -hmm. for it. Okay. Um, what was the condition of the area when you found it? Yeah, it was very wintry. It was, just a, it it was, was just a, giant a iceberg. solid iceberg. Mm -hmm. And that's it? We were we were digging for hours. Oh, okay. okay. So <laughs> yeah, we even went there. under the water. Like okay. Under the water into the iceberg. It was crazy. Mm -hmm. I see. Yeah, it's okay. quite tragic. We we were curious because when we went there, we saw that it had been excavated already. We did a bit of further oh. investigation on oh, our own. Oh yeah. Oh, my. And so we we weren't we weren't sure if that was you or if someone had to come before you or after you. Is what we were looking to see. Oh, oh that was definitely us then. Yeah. Okay. So there wasn't so there wasn't anything there at all prior to that then. No, no. there was there was nothing, just ice and snow and water. Interesting. So someone led us to the same place then? Yes. yes it seems like it. Yeah. Well, we we still need to check in with the Winter Kingdom and see if they have received any reports of mm -hmm. the same. Um because they may have the final piece of the story that we're missing presently. Then yes. did every princess receive one that you've talked to other than the Winter Kingdom? Um, yes. That is correct. So the mermaid and the nether, or is the yes. nether not? The nether did receive one, and they actually explored in the nether to those coordinates, and obviously there was nothing there. Well, that's, that's even stranger that someone got into the nether with the borders being kind of closed off. This makes so. me feel uneasy, the fact that people, some, someone or something is trying I to think obviously get our attention. And getting I into think places they something. shouldn't be able to get into. Mm, true. true. Or sending us on a wild goose chase, it seems like. Mm -hmm. yes, to distract I us really from a different matter? That aspect. That was the case. Yes, and that's definitely a theory. The other possibility, like I said, is that if perhaps, if, if the Winter Kingdom were to arrive there first, maybe they did find something there. And simply because they haven't shared that with us, we wouldn't know if something were to be there. And so the rest of mm -hmm. us obviously didn't find anything. So my hope, ideally, 
is that perhaps they did find something, but what does bring to my concern is that if they didn't mention this, why would they choose to keep it a secret from the rest of the kingdoms? I have a question. Have we considered that whoever's dropping these coordinates off um, to the princess's bedrooms, it seems like there would have to be a variety because there would have to have been something that could fly up to Princess Rain's room. Um, you mentioned that there was one found in the nether as well. There would have to have been somebody that was capable of even getting there. there there's just, it seems like there, it, if, if this is an attack, it seems like it's a group attack. Well, don't, aren't the nether beings able to fly as well? Just less. Yes, they can. So they themselves need all those requirements. Well, except for they cannot Actually. enter the water without dying, so they wouldn't have been able to yeah, reach oh, the yeah. mermaid kingdom. Mm -hmm. That's fair. So, at the very least, a, a, a coupling, a twosome. Oh, you think maybe a group? Yes. That's hmm. what I'm getting out of it. Well, we couldn't... It's not entirely a bad theory. Yes. But I do think this calls for maybe a meeting with all five princesses. Um sooner rather than later to discuss and maybe we can discover some truths if we all come together mm -hmm. that's probably a good idea should we also bring the package that we received like the book to e see if they all led to the same place yes or... i agree maybe just to double check well um, i have a question yes you, you why did you say that it was obvious that the netherians didn't find anything when they went to the coordinates oh well just because thought if we didn't find anything here in the overworld why would they find anything in the nether but that's fair okay it was, seems to be some sort of trick or prank or i'm not sure like mm -hmm. my advisor mentioned a way to bring us together but why if we use the context clues of everyone's story chronologically, it seems as though um, Princess Rain and her sisters potentially arrived there first as well. Do you think that has something to do with the timing of when everyone received these packages? Um, I don't know, because we... it's hard to tell the date. We received the package, but then our journey was cut short, oh, okay. and we had to delay our journey. So, mm -hmm. quite a few days, in fact. Um, I don't okay. know if we would have made it before you or at the same time. Interesting. Yeah. Well, I know we, after we arrived home um, from our time away from Stratus, we, we pretty much went the next day that we arrived home. Okay. okay. Our wings did not thank us for that, but... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's a lot of out of us for flying around. Okay. Well, um, then I shall prepare a meeting for all of us and um, make sure that we can all come and discuss. And then I'll send maybe my messenger to send you a letter on the details of our meeting. Of course. Uh, well, I look forward to hearing it and hopefully we can get this sort it out and find the, the culprit yes all right well thank you so much for coming here i'm glad we could discuss these things and i'll be sure to i have not forgotten our previous concern and i'll make sure i'll talk with that subject all right well thank you for hosting and um we shall hear from you soon safe travels oh, well, back to your add, kingdom oh yes I, I, the yeah. amount of times that i came and visit which is three times now four uh i just want to say how breathtaking and beautiful your kingdom is and all of your subjects seems to be very very lovely for the most part oh thank you for saying that well You're i welcome. hope someday i can come visit the cloud kingdom i'm sure yes, it's maybe we can arrange a tea party oh that would be we, wonderful we do love having Please. a tea party Safe travels <laughs> once again. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, wait, how do we get out of here? Oh, uh, um, uh, here. Oh, yeah. I. Yes, yeah, so you're more than welcome to follow. Uh... All right, here is the Thank portal. I, Thank you. I did for... bring some pearls. So oh, oh you guys my goodness. Share amongst yourselves. <laughs> oh, oh uh, share amongst Thank yourselves. Thank you so much, Theo. Pearl. <laughs> Thank you. You're so pretty. You're welcome. Good day. Good day. Right. Lovely to meet journey. you. Lovely to meet you all too. You as Thank well. you for having us. Of course. No Come again sometime. 
was exhausting. Oh, I need a bath. Okay. Are you alright? <laughs> yes, I was very nervous about that whole interaction, to be honest. So I completely understand. Well, thank you very much for coming again. Yes, thank you. Bye-bye. Safe travels. <sighs> okay. I had to... I'm sorry. I had to let that out. <laughs> no, you're fine. It's more than understandable. Um, so the concern was not as dramatic as I was envisioning it. No. But, no. Um, Thankfully. So, something I will take care of. It is actually something I was thinking about um, because I noticed some chickens in a very, very sad enclosure. So I made um, a royal enclosure, if you will. Um, <laughs> well, oh. Uh, for them because I felt bad for the mm -hmm. creatures. I do not mind actually making sure that all the animals that are in elven care are actually well taken care of. The whole like the whole yeah. royal group came. It's to talk obviously about this something issue. that they very care a lot about. Anyways, we're supposed to be re yeah. representing that we respect life, and if we're not showing that, then I'm not surprised that they were concerned. <laughs> Perhaps at some point, you know, beyond the council, it might be worth having a, a time where we can all reconvene as a kingdom, if possible, and just make sure all our affairs are in order. Yes, I agree. Oh, um, Theo, may I please have that um, book and quill back? Oh. Did you I not receive it back? Still has it. Okay. No, that's I didn't right. Get it back. Okay. But, but I did bring some straw to make some more. Oh, okay, great. Okay, well, all right. Um, did you want to discuss things now? Um, I, I certainly can, if you wish. I um, yes, let's I'm discuss, and um, and then I will show you what I've been up to. <laughs> uh, oh, okay. They have been my a little is, busy. My doors are always open, so. Thank you, Theo. If if you need to send over a message, just let me know. I will. I will probably have you, you will be taking a very long, large trip to all five realms of the kingdom soon, um, except yeah, the nether, of I course. Will, I, I will accompany him to the other kingdoms just to make sure he's safe. Thank you. I appreciate that. I, I won't make the biggest mistake of my life and almost hurt myself on my way. Uh, yes, please avoid <laughs> doing so. <laughs> yeah, that's why I have my stinking cousin over here. But, uh -huh. you know. Whatever, old man. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Alright, Captain. Um, If I could actually have you go... I, I was going to give you a book and quill. But if you have one or you're able to make one, I want you to go around um, the structures of the kingdom and maybe do a report for me of all the conditions of the animals around the area, if you do not mind. Mm. You have that straw yeah. still, right, princess? I do. Okay, because with that straw, you should be able to just make um, a canvas with four of them together in one full and one regular crafting grid. You just make a canvas with four of them, <coughs> like you would a crafting table. Okay. And if you put that together, then you can just put that together with an ink sack and a feather. And I've got a feather inside of my room. Ink sack, we might have to find a way to get one, but we certainly can create one. Okay. I have been finding ink sacks all around, so... Just randomly? Yeah. Yeah, that does happen I sometimes. I my feathers recently, so I don't have any of them with me. I might have um, feathers, but I'll have to access them later. Yeah, I think I actually might have feathers too, so... I okay. I'll just go double check. So yes, if you could go off and do that for me and then bring the report back to me, I would highly appreciate that. Right, and like I said... I will keep uh, an eye around the land to make sure there's no suspicious behavior. I'll check all directions just to make sure there's no clues as to where the other princess has went. Indeed. Wonderful plan. Okay. Thank you. No problem. Stay safe. You as well. Craig. Okay. All right. All right. Let's let's down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, lots of things happening. Of royalty. Um, let me show you both what I have been up to. I'm certainly quite interested to see this. Um, this is, might be a little bit of an ambitious... Okay, I'll show you the less ambitious project. You might see the ambitious project on the way to the lesser project, but 
I was feeling inspired, also bored, but inspired. Um, okay, okay. And I have created a little farm. Welcome to our stairway. Um, don't worry about that. What? That was me. <laughs> what? I, I should guess I should repair it until I'm actually finished with my ambitious project. But this way, I have created a little outskirt of an farming area for all of the elves to use. Because I thought it would it would just be nice to have food provided for everybody. Oh. So this is the um, chicken coop that I created because they were um, they were surrounded by copper bars before. <laughs> And I thought it was a little sad. Ah, yes. So I upgraded their home. Now they have a lot more cozy of a place to be. Wonderful. Looks very nice. And then I have also kind of turned this existing structure into a farm. So oh, for everyone to use. I was wondering. I saw this the other day. It's quite nice. Yeah, so and I think there's wheat over here, and then um, potatoes, plenty of potatoes. We will not starve. Ah, uh, yes. So. That's perfect. Yes. I didn't explore this area earlier, because I wanted to see what was new around the kingdom. Oh, good. Oh, well, now you know who did it. That was me. And now for the project that I know you haven't seen, because I just started working on it today. I've totally seen it. Oh, you did? I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm not even sure what I'm talking about. Okay. I was trying to give you a hard time. I was going to say, you would have had to walk outside of the castle. Are you saying I don't? I, I walk outside the castle quite often. You just don't see me do it. Oh, you do? See, I had the I impression you didn't. I I go on many adventures. So, um, don't be concerned. I promise it's oh, yeah, not right. as Are bad as it looks. Wall? <laughs> no, well, yes, but no, it's not going to be like a wall. It looks better from this side. Okay? Oh, I see. It's very front facing. Yes, but I was wanted to do a little pier and then an underground tunnel for the mermaids to reach the castle at some point. Oh, that's a very wonderful idea. So, and I thought the pier could have a, like a marketplace and we can have all of the shops for, since we are welcoming all of the kingdoms, we could have um, lots of shops and trading areas. That is very true. We could also, you know, if, if that ends up being uh, an economy we wish to pursue, we always can open up shops for other kingdoms to come and claim and we can you know, contract them out and they can, you know, potentially have their own shops here for goods that they can only sell in their own locations. Yes, this is what I've been working on. And the subjects have been very helpful bringing me materials so far. So I haven't had to do all of this by myself. It's been a group project. I see. Well, that is, I'm glad to hear that. That is quite excellent. It looks very nice. Thank you. It does need some lighting, though, yeah, it seems. You. Oh, thank yes, you, Anthony. Yeah. So it, yeah, from the back, it doesn't look so great, but the front, it looks much better. It looks a little more promising. <laughs> yes. So I'll definitely have to terraform a lot. It's understandable. There's plenty of time. But yeah, but so that's my it. building materials. Oh, there's my shield. Make it tricky. Okay. I was wondering where that went. <laughs> she misplaced shield. I just emptied my inventory. I didn't realize that I threw that in there and I went mining without it oh, and dear. I was like where's my shield <laughs> they have the shield on right now I do now you just can't oh, see it can, I yeah. hit it with magic so, so what exactly happened to the bottom of our stairs no. okay so I removed it because I was like mm, I'm gonna raise the level of the ground and then I realized I did not have enough dirt so um uh, here I'll make it at least pretty for a second this is at least a little easier now but yes that's so, what I've been up to with my free time well, yes. Well, like you said, we probably should do some. If we want to do some planning, we certainly can't into that. Um, unfortunately, we obviously don't have a book we can plan with. I mean, I do have a book. I do have um, one. Yes, a secret book. I must get there before he you know, gets there. Hurry, secret book. Haste, 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 haste. Secret book. <laughs> you what cannot see the. You cannot see me? the contents of this book. So I must erase oh, it. Is it what kind of contents are inside this book that I can't see? I'm your advisor. Okay, I got it. We're good. Okay, erase oh, this. this. Erase that. I'm er erase that. It's fine. It's nothing dangerous. I'm not. I'm a good child. 
Oh, is this is, is this the thing that has to do with the invitation that you sent without telling me about it? The what? 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 <laughs> yeah, no, the the message you sent to the Mermaid Kingdom. No. <laughs> oh. Um. <laughs> hey. You keep trying to hide this, and it's very Anthony. Hard, how does he you... know about that? <laughs> it's called. I didn't say anything. It's called, as your advisor, I have the right to search your room for any... Uh, <gasps> you things. already searched my room? Not entirely, but I, I do search through things occasionally just to make sure there's nothing, like, dangerous in here. Okay, well... I am allowed where, to be a Okay, punch. if you actually found it, then where was it? It was inside of this drawer right here. Oh, crap, I knew I should have done a better oh, hiding no. spot. <laughs> I thought maybe if it was out in the open, it wouldn't be found. Well, now that you're you out, I, can, I you're 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 you can I at least keep it? Can I at least keep it? Keep what? The book? No. Oh. The thing that was with the book. The mermaid tail? <laughs> yes. Oh, you know about that? <laughs> That's what we're talking about, Anthony. Oh my goodness, Matt. Anthony, I just, I just, okay, you know what? Now, I, the thing is, you have the tail, but you're not a mermaid, so you can't exactly use it. I can use it, watch. <laughs> are you going to go swimming in the water and show me you can use a tail? What? Both of you? <laughs> both of you have this? Swim away! Swim away! How did this... But wait, did, 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 do you have to have the tail on for it to work? Um, you have to wear this necklace. So I okay, I guess if I, I lose I like, it... I don't, remember, I don't recall you having a mermaid tail when we went adventuring all the way <laughs> through the north. No, I made sure I did not bring that. I had to put it away. Okay. You know, you know I probably should be thankful that you would horrible, both are horrible at hiding secrets. <laughs> uh, I had mine longer than... Excuse me, I, I knew from the moment that you guys were talking about having things would be like, mm, nothing, we've done nothing wrong. Just, hey, it's harmless. So... Ah! The mermaid I princess was happy to but... provide them for us. I... And now we can yeah, visit the mermaid kingdom. That is wonder... We could visit them anywhere, you don't need tails to do that. But now we can swim underneath the water. You can swim in the water anytime you want. No, 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 no. This is different. We can Have breathe you... underwater. Do you realize that having these tails means that you make it e easier for yourself to do these things instead of actually relying on learning how to swim? Because what happens if you don't have your necklace? You could drown and die. You were worried about me drowning all the time. Well, perhaps maybe you should be the one being concerned. Well, then I'll just never take the necklace off. That's not the solution. <laughs> do you, you should not rely on magic to solve your problems. Oh my goodness. This is magic, is it not? It's an internal part of the elves. We can't exactly stop doing that. I can see you. It's not like I can't see you. My elven eyes know how to tell when you're invisible. It's still harder to see us, though. Why are you even running away in the first place? Why are you running? Why are you running? <laughs> run! Run, Anthony, run! <laughs> you are both so <laughs> immature. This is ridiculous. Stop <laughs> running around. We have something very... We haven't even started our planning yet. I know oh, apparently we can't do I this can... invisible. Can't... But Mermaid Tail does not work invisible. Well, that's good. Okay, can't go... Wee! Oh, absolutely We're not as fast. Uh, yes, oh. what is it, Craig? Uh... I do have gifts for Princess Mako and Lord Anthony. Oh. Okay. Oh. Ooh! Oh. <gasps> wow! Oh my goodness! Princess, this one is for you. <gasps> and Lord Anthony, the one in green is for you. Oh. Wow. wow. Thank you! Well. <laughs> this is so cool. That is lovely and it's very awesome. I will have to, to inform you, though, that unless we have a stable nearby, you will not be able to keep these things in the kingdom. Uh, don't we worry. A stable, a stable is being built soon. Okay, wonderful. Because we are not going to have a castle. We're not going to have horses in the castle. They'll poop everywhere. I went in my well, room. you have, like, five dogs in the castle. You're not keeping a <laughs> horse in your bedroom. Oh, and uh, here's that report. Oh, thank you, thank you. Oh, you're quite fast. Well, it's not that big, so. Oh, that's very And have moved to or not. Good to know. Thank you very much. What do you... Yep. Oh, and I do have more I books for you. Oh, perfect. Oh, good. Oh, yes, this is perfect. One for each princess. This is very distant. Great. Okay. I yeah. guess we don't need to use the one that I previously okay. used, but I erased. Oh, lovely distraction from our problems, right, Anthony? Well, well you know, it's not uh, only a distraction. <laughs> Thank you, Anthony, for bringing us back to the real serious issues here right now. I appreciate you so much. 
Is that sarcasm? <laughs> I just, you know, I'm... It's a it's both. I'm glad that you had the least audacity to mention that again after all we've gone through so far today. Um, you know, we might as well... Just... Oh, well, I guess there's no mermaids then currently here. Oh. I was gonna say, why don't we just go on an adventure? Right, Anthony? Oh yeah, perfect. Okay, yeah. let's go. It's kind of distracted from our problems. Excuse yeah. what <laughs> it's not how we were supposed to be planning the council meeting. Oh true. You well dead. oh you know what? This is perfect. We'll write the things and then um we can drop it off in the Mermaid Kingdom. You can come with, but we get to go swim down in the, the castle. Hmm. I can swim in the water too. I I know how to swim. Yeah, but you can't that breathe really underwater. Idea. You'll have like, I don't know, what a minute before you start drowning. Well, I I I'll have to swim for a long period of time. It's not like it's important. How long can you hold your breath? I've I've I have learned how to hold my breath for quite a substantial amount of time. Actually, I'll have you know. Yes, Craig. Hello. Yeah, the horses have been dropped off by the chicken coop. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Appreciate it. Uh, is there anything else you need from me, or um, would you like me to start scouring? No, but if you do want to continue, you know, gathering for, I mean, obviously you do not have to. If you want to pursue other things, please do so. You do not have to grind on my behalf. But if you want to, I would highly appreciate it, especially dirt. Dirt? Uh, yeah, I can get you dirt. I'm talking like is two it... double chests full of dirt. Like that's probably how much we're going to need. I would oh my goodness, maybe this is invest this feels very in. Very familiar to me. <laughs> maybe in another life, I remember Maddie, a person <laughs> that looked very similar to you, asking for lots of dirt for some particularly <laughs> strange purpose. Oh. Holy hell! <laughs> two double chests. And I'm already working on the stone bricks and green logs for you, as you requested. Thank you. And I, bel and I believe Charlotte is home if you do want to go talk to her. Oh, boy. Okay. Thank you. Again, it's not, it's not entirely up to you, Craig. You do not yeah. have to do it. Yes, you do not have to do that. It, but... but that's my goal. If you... I'm already grinding out the other stuff. <laughs> I'll the pile. <laughs> don't, then don't worry about it. But maybe just think of it. Like, if you see a pile of dirt and you're yeah. like, oh, Princess Maho needs this. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That'd be great. Much appreciated. But yes, you do not have to <laughs> spend endless hours on my behalf i will put in mm. work too i think i'll start my investigation towards the door all right okay the plan. lovely seeing you two again or three and yes. have a wonderful day thanks you, you okay. too all right. all right now back to the planning adventure no planning adventure i'll do coral first princess coral oh, something still i have a curious as well i I haven't talked to them about it, but something we definitely want to bring up the meeting is about these keys. Because we received this elven key of an emerald. Oh! Uh, yes! I didn't even rem I forgot about that part. I had for a while as well, but then I remembered it when I had my inventory. Because you gave it to me, and so I've had it this whole time. And so we definitely probably want to make sure we bring those. Um, maybe yes, worth yes, please. Please bring... I don't know if they received the key as well, but we definitely know that it probably is a book related. With coordinates, if they did not already discard it, I have to write this and five thoughts, times. And I'm not necessarily looking at you. I'm just looking in your general direction. I promise. I'm not. I'm... Should I sign this? Maybe I should sign this. No, but that's a waste of books. But they're probably not going to give it back to me. Another princess. I'll give that one to you. And mermaid princess. Okay. Thank you. And <clears throat> thank you. And would you like us to go ahead and deliver the cloud one? Yeah, you can. Yes. And it seems like there is also a mermaid present as well. Uh, I think Charlotte is over at their house now. If you would like to meet them. Or uh, what do you, you don't have to if you don't want to. What do you think, Kena? Uh, this is the moment where I say as the advisor, it is entirely up to you how you wish to deal with your time. Um, so if you'd like to speak with Charlotte now, you certainly can, or you certainly could, uh, send her a missive and let her know that you'd like to meet her at some point in the future, but perhaps not tonight. Alright, I shall go over there. Um, I'll go with you, Captain. Um, Anthony, do you want to join me, or are you going to do your own thing? I can stay with Nima. 
Okay, you two oh, shall lovely. stay here? Sure. I will keep an eye on Lord Anthony. <laughs> All right, great. Have fun babysitting. All right, let's go. Thank you. Babysitting. <laughs> well, yes. If you're going to be here, I think I'm going to keep my eye on I'm going to go to the Luxol Martron portal. So we can, we can stop on my room first. All right, I shall be there. Um, All right. Oh, I'm seeing that effect from the conduit. Yes. Okay, dokey. Yeah. I'm no going way. to use this. No way. They're right there. Boat. No. Oh, hell, would you like to hop in? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Water. Just right over to the other side. This is a really cute house. Look at this thing I got. I got Craig. There's not a really easy way to get to this house, is there? Not yet. All right. Hello. Oh, hello. Hi, Charlotte. Hi, Theo. Um, were you aware that I was arriving? Um. Not really. May I ask why you're here? Um, I had received a report. In fact, the entire Cloud Kingdom Council on this report. Yes. Oh? Very concerned about the conditions of your animals on your property. Oh. Yes. Specifically, I, mean, I think the, the one they were most concerned about was a certain bee. Bubble bee. I don't... I don't think I have my the bee anymore, I'll be honest. Yeah, I just yeah, wanted to... I didn't... I didn't mention that they didn't have it anymore. Yeah, I just wanted to bring that to your attention, that the entire Cloud Council came with I... these concerns about your property, so... I only met one or two, only two Cloud people. I met the Precious Galaxy and I believe the Knight. I cannot remember the name. I might pause you. <laughs> Whatever plans you do have with um, these animals, maybe to speed up the process in case you have any other oh. visitors. Yeah, I'm currently over there. I'm building a barn for me. <laughs> animals over here. Okay. Uh, may yeah. Perhaps I will... Do you mind if I commission both... Craig and Theo to aid you in the building to speed up the process. Yeah, so that would help a lot. Okay, can you two do that? Yes. Okay, so you can, can retire like from your current project <laughs> that you are oh. doing. Um, and <laughs> yes, this will be the priority for now, just so that we don't have any more concerned seraphs coming over here. Thank you so much. Sorry for the trouble behind us. That's all right. And I did hear about your project for wanting a stable. Um, I have yes. a vision to put it maybe near the community farm. So I will mark out oh. a spot for you where you can build it. Yeah, I'll let you know when um, I have finished doing that. All right. I shall return to the castle. Um, Captain Thank K, goodness. you are free. I will shall return by myself. I promise I will be fine. And you can go ahead and get started on this project. Oh, I will accompany you back over there just so, it, so you can Okay, fine. You can accompany me to the portal <laughs> if you would, if that makes you feel better. Well, I think it would make Kano feel better. I, I, Kano doesn't have to know. <laughs> oh, goodness. You're joking. Uh -oh. oh, actually, before I leave, I would like to see this um, skeleton spawner. Oh, wait. I forgot about that. Uh, we have this over here. Yes, there's two entrances. Uh, this is for like the storage and stuff. Like easily, like in case you need an extra bow, arrows in here. So. I definitely. Oh goodness. Wow. <laughs> All right. <laughs> definitely uh, need those. Someone said grinding. Oh <laughs> my <laughs> goodness. Well, I guess we're not short on these things. That's for sure. And it. As you can see. Using my spare time. Yes, you can see them down there already. In case it's any problems, we can second it and make sure it's working. And it's gonna take a while to get over here because we win it pretty spite and adding it where to put it. And over here. Okay. Sweet. I don't. Oh, wait, there. I do have a sword. Wow. Alright. <laughs> Is 
So, so you can be here to grind, play levels if needed. Nice. All right. Alrighty. Where am I? Oh my goodness. All right. My brother yeah. apparently is ahead of me in the diamond department. <laughs> You would think the own princess of this realm would have some diamond by now. I shall see you both again soon. Good luck on the project of the barn. And I will come see it when it is finished. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Alright, let us depart. I shall see what my brother is up to. Oh, and if you have one second, I'd like to show you something. Oh, sure. Wow, it I is... don't know if you've seen the... <gasps> this the is beautiful there. over here. And then just through here, this is where we have our enchanter. Oh, wow. Very pretty. Oh, frogs. <laughs> yes. We're working okay. on a pond for them. Perfect. Thank you. That will be useful. So, yeah, feel free to use this space if you ever need to. Thank you. Yeah, you might. Yeah. I might possibly come over. Although, we should out definitely have one near the castle. I'll have to work on that. But, this place is lovely. It's very ethereal. I love it. I have several right, well, projects uh, going on. All right, T. Yeah. I will take I will it from here. You know send, and we, I will let you know when we send the messages. Okay, thank you so much. No problem. Safe travels. Thank you. All right, that was quite the day definitely got a lot of a princess chores done i have more to do i will spend some more time just working on the terraforming slash reconstruction oh hello you over there let me just practice some of my bow nice shot all right yeah, the construction over there. That'll take me quite a long time. Maybe I'll even uh, stream that a little bit over on Twitch. If you want to j see it on Twitch, um, you can follow me at my home Maddie. Same as my YouTube. Very easy to find me. We can end this on the balcony. The rainy balcony. I love this atmosphere. Thank you so, so much for watching this episode of The Princess SMP. If you made it to the end of this video please let me know by telling me in the comments below what your favorite minecraft mob is mine would have to probably be the axolotl it's so cute all right i will see you in the next episode bye